Hello, hello. So Ubuntu 18.04 LTS is running the new GNOME desktop environment. It's a customized version of it. And because of that, I had some issues with this um, applications extension. Uh, and um, I had some issues with some other extensions as well, but mainly this one. It, uh, you can install it, but uh, it didn't work, it didn't show up. So I decided to actually install the regular sort of GNOME desktop environment. So yeah, I am on the um, LTS and uh, yeah so this is kind of how I did it and um, there was a little bit of a trick to do this. Um, first you had to actually install the NVIDIA drivers because when I installed the GNOME desktop environment uh, it didn't work. <laughs> well it, it was installed but I wasn't getting the display so I had to go to uh, this software and updates and I went to the other software here and click add and added BPA the graphics drivers and uh, click add source uh, type your password and when that was done I just selected close and then uh, reload button and then I went in here again and went to additional drivers and I selected the uh, sort of latest version of the drivers here and installed that and after that was in installed I rebooted or restarted the computer logged in again and then it was actually time to uh, install the uh, default GNOME. So I went to the terminal and over here I just typed sudo opt get install and uh, GNOME session. So that's what I typed and I have it already installed so I'm not going to do it again but I let it install and then I actually restarted the computer again uh, it's not enough with you know log out nope you need to actually restart the computer so uh, yeah after that I now have the gnome default gnome and if I open for example this and by the way when you uh, log in next time you know I have an image here you know you have your name and you click on it and then you get this cogwheel you click on that and the default setting is the Ubuntu but you change that to GNOME on Xorg and this is kind of what's important to have the NVIDIA drivers so you need to have this selected and then you type your password and log in and then you get the regular GNOME kind of desktop environment as you can see it looks a bit different you know you don't have the black bars at the top and stuff like that and if I also go to tweak tools you see it's slightly different and also for example if you are in here and you want the uh, maximize and minimize you need to go to, into windows here and toggle them on and you can have them on the left side as well and then you also get this stuff there so yeah it depends how you want it so yeah I am actually on the GNOME desktop 
the standard ones and I finally got these applications now we can go over here so you don't need to uh, do this all the time so you can go right here graphics stuff so yeah that's kind of how you do it so see you later